Hey guys, it's Piotr, and today we'll be doing a simple portal effect. Why? Because it's easy and you can learn a lot. Boke Photos. Affinity Photo. Hi everyone. Pretty much the portal effect will be only four photographies or images. We need our portal, light ring in that case, our landscape that we'll be looking at through the portal and a silhouette of a girl or any other person that will be looking at the portal also. So what I'm doing right now is just simply placing all the images more or less when I would see them fit everything. Let's make this a little bit smaller and let's make this a lot smaller. Yes, so the perspective as you can see with our main road here should be i would like to be corresponding with the image inside of the portal okay so this would be something like that and the girl will be looking at the portal in the end so guys classic masking color grading adding some light and then checking everything out and if it will look good if it will look good let's start Let's hide the layer with the girl. Our portal. W for the selection brush. Just a rough selection inside our light ring. Click on the landscape layer and click the mask icon. Boom, there we have it. Perfection. So what now? The portal. It's yellowy. Too yellowy. Look at the walls. It's orange, gritty, dirty, nasty, city, ugly. Let's change those colors with the HSL adjustment layer. Select yellow, desaturate this a little bit and add a little bit of red. Yes, something exactly like that. Now, the portal is very artificial. Like you can see that there's a vector graphic being thrown out from something else. So I would add noise, not the noise, sorry. Add noise, so we will have the same grating as in the walls this high iso effect so add noise around 20 percent yeah i would say even maybe 23 let's leave it at that okay so now we have our color okay the color grading for the portal the effect is also a lot better let's add light Add a new pixel layer, select the color picker, select the radius 5 on 5, click somewhere in the portal like here, where we have the vibrant color, select the regular paintbrush tool, select the color that we just picked, and just paint light all around the portal, like this would be the places where everything would be glowing, that wall here, it looks ugly, but we are using the soft light for blending mode and it looks a lot better. Okay, so we have this. The color is nice. It's a lot more vibrant because it's the highlights. So it should be like that. I wouldn't remove and change the same thing. It adds the, I would say, well, vibrance and vitality, the whole picture. We can change the colors, however, inside in, the, in our landscape. Let's select those greens or yellows and try to make it a little bit more autumn. So it will look a lot like the image outside of the portal. Okay, that's great. So the last part, let's cut out our girl and make her look through the portal. So we go in, selection brush tool and just make a rough selection, refine the selection, check the hair, more or less, because remember, we are used, we are learning the rules, not doing this perfectly. Okay, this looks nice. Let's be click refine. Okay, set border width to zero. 
so we won't have any lines, white artifacts, etc. And let's maybe just refine the hair a little bit, because it's always sticking out in the end. The rest looks okay. Output to a mask. And then we, there we have it. Now it should, should be here. Well, not really. Rather here, so her eyesight will be directed inside of the portal. Oh, maybe a little bit here. Okay, great. So now, color grading. Uh, the picture of the girl is very, very clean. So we also need to... I would add noise. Just to make it a little bit more rough. Let's go with this 21%. Yeah, okay. This looks okay for me. Let's add the HSL adjustment layer. And her hair... This is a little bit too orange for me. I would desaturate this also. So it will be corresponding with the walls and the whole environment. Okay, great. Now that blue color, a lot too blue. Let's remove those colors like that. And guys and girls, there we have it. This is how you can create a simple portal effect in a Fini Photo or Photoshop or any other software, the rules are the same. You are picking your portal, whatever image this is, this is solely up to you. I got something like that. You pick something inside the portal. This is, this might be a landscape or someone else trying to walk out of it. Remember about the color grading, about every other layer you're using and the whole scene. Add lights and highlights. The blending modes are your friend. Cut out a person or two, fix the colors. Tell me in the comment section what would you do differently or better. Thanks for tuning in and have a nice day.